Hey everyone, Big Bang here. Welcome to our uh, next level of Let's Play Blizzard Plus. So I was just finishing up Hampton's mini game here. Uh, not too exciting. Anyway, then uh, we are now going into stage five of Buster Bus Loose. Uh, whew, that game was too close. Now I would like to introduce my friend Calamity Coyote. He's not a sports buff, but he is clever and sometimes invents things. Buster, could you do me a favor? Sure, Calamity. What is it? I hit a very important item way, way up in the sky, but I can't remember where I hit it. Could you find it for me? No problem! Consider it done! Go to the plaza and push the button on the capsule. This will allow you to go up higher. By the way, how did you hide it up so high? To which Calamity has no response. So welcome to the sky level. Um, if you play this game on easy mode, you will not access the sky level. Yeah, that just happened. <laughs> With this massive balloon just floating up into space. The sky level is not necessarily hard, but it has its difficult points. One is just a lot of platforming. So here we've got Hampton in an airplane, of course, shooting out bubbles. And of course, unfortunately, after a while, these bubbles will start popping in succession. So... You just gotta keep you know keep an eye out for which bubbles are about to pop and whether or not you, which ones you need to land on. So again, not necessarily too hard. You just gotta keep a your you know just keep an eye on everything. Uh, see when bubble bubbles are about to pop and stuff. But there are a couple of occasional stars just floating around. They're not really too important. If 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 you can pick one up, go for it. But it's not crucial by any means. Uh, okay, Ooh, that was close. Of course, the stars can be a little distracting sometimes, and for a long time I was like, where do we keep going? We keep going up. No, no, we're just, we just walk to the side. Uh, so now we have to jump on some, well, we were going to jump on some balloons, but now we're not. Let's try it again and jump. Again, this is just mostly platforming. Uh-oh. Oof, just in time. Good catch. Uh, not all balloons will pop. These ones will just kind of float down and then pick back up after a while. Who knows how they managed to stay suspended in air perfectly well. But if you climb up this way, there's a 1-up. Yay! Uh, you can be dangerous and try and jump dash this whole thing. Um, it's possible. Now for the blimp. The blimp is perhaps the most annoying part of this stage. I don't know. Especially, uh, not in, not in normal mode, but... Uh, in the future, we'll, I'll show you guys some hazards of this blimp part of the level. Uh, obviously, we're being attacked a lot. And as far as I know, I mean, they're... As far as I know, there isn't uh, any health pickups in this level that I can think of right away. That was close. That was way too close. <laughs> anyway, so yeah, you've got these uh, these buzzards attacking constantly. So unfortunately, yeah, you're you know you're bound to get like you're likely to get hit here if anywhere in the level. So e okay. Uh, still not out of the woods yet. We still got a row of four. We got this row. Let's jump dash. Okay. All, uh, watch yourself, Buster. There we go. Whew. Careful, Buster. You, yeah, you, you've got to be super careful with this. Okay, I think we're good. I think we're good. I think that was the last bit. Is it? And, of course, what happens to blimps? They pop, but we get saved, so good for that. Now for the weird part of the stage. The pinball game. Why there's a pinball game in the middle of the sky? I don't know. Is this part of Calamity's ridiculous plot to hide whatever he was hiding? I don't know. It's just kind of here. So in that sense, it kind of feels like a bonus level. In the sense that, I mean, it's pinball. The, the the bumpers are going by themselves, so I don't have to be pressing anything. There is this little platform that we have to try and jump onto. So let's see if we can get on it. Yes. And of course, climb higher. And obviously, we, in order to keep advancing up, we're going to have to pick up all these little uh, balls. So let's, let's get to it. All right. And... Again, this part, again, not necessarily hard, but just... Uh, okay, and... Oh, I thought I got that one. Alright, there we go. So, again, we're almost done with stage 5. Stage 5 itself is also kind of on the short side. I mean, you know, we look inside this little vault thing, and... Oh, stars, yay! <coughs> and that's pretty much the end of the level. This book must be what Calamity was talking about. Hey, this is the script for the next episode. Whoa. Oh no, the building's about to collapse. I must get out of here immediately. 
Run, Buster, run! Run away, Buster! Uh, welcome to the exciting part of the stage. Basically, there's a lot of Dota statues, and you need to use all of them in order to escape the collapsing building. Uh, obviously, there are occasionally stars and stuff that help you on your way, but for the most part, you've got to do this in one take without messing up. Otherwise, you're dead. Of course, that was it. That was the whole level by itself. So again, nothing terribly exciting, but again, it might take a couple of lives just to get through it. Um, Alrighty, so let us uh, spin this game, spin this wheel, see what game pops up. And it is gonna be... Hampton... Okay, screw it. Alright, Big Mac, see you later. <laughs>